I'm Lee Chantel from VivaLaVegan.net and welcome to this week's um, vegan food tutorial video. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure that you do. And I'm going to make today for you a chia pudding. And the ingredients we have here is one cup of chia seeds. You can buy these at most health food stores and now I've seen supermarkets selling them actually in the past few years. We've got 500 grams of um, mixed frozen fruit. You can use whatever fruit you like. I just like the mixed berries, so that's why I'm using that. And we have one liter of um, some sort of cruelty-free milk. And I like brown rice milk, that's why I'm using this one here. And what we're going to do is put the one cup of chia seeds into a bowl. I use a um, Tupperware bowl sometimes when I'm making this at home because it just seems to fit it all well. Now you need, say I've got, I've got one cup of the chia seeds and we need four cups of liquid to make that. So whatever you like to use, you can use. I'm just going to pour a bit of the milk in here and what we're going to do is whisk it. Now it's very, very important to make sure that every single little chia seed has liquid on it so that it can actually absorb the liquid. It's really easy because there's no gluten in this and depending on what sort of milk it, um, it can be really good for you and it's really really easy to make and you can make a big batch once a week and have it in your um, fridge ready for breakfast every morning. So I've used all that four cups of the um, rice milk and if you can see every sort of chia seed seems to have the milk or the liquid through it. So that's what we want. And just try and get some of those chia seeds from the side down in it as well. What we're going to do is leave this for about half an hour, then we're going to mix in the berries and I will see you for that part. So this is the chia pudding now, note the consistency. And we've left that for about an hour and we're going to just add in the mixed frozen berries to this just to ensure that they're all mixed through and we're going to leave that for about half an hour or so again but if you don't have the time you can just mix it together now if you don't mind it being a bit cold on your teeth and um, you could have this for breakfast or you could just have it now as a snack I might give my uh, lovely film person Cam some of this now because I'm sure he'll like it. So um, what you can do, just put a couple of spoonfuls in a bowl. You might have seen the um, coconut yogurt that we made. So I'm going to put a couple of spoonfuls of that on top here. What else have I got? I've got some coconut flakes. Woo! And then we've also got some cacao nibs. So I'm going to put all that on there. And then I'm going to give that to Cam to eat. Yes, thank you. And so that's how you make a very easy chia pudding. I hope you've liked it and I hope you love it as well. This has been one of the things that I have for breakfast pretty much every day since about 2011 when I was at the Vita Vegan Con in Portland, Oregon, which this year will be in Texas. And I won't be there, but hi to everyone there and I'll see you at the next one. Make sure you check out our other video tutorials for great, easy to make vegan food and see vivalavegan.net for more information.